In this video we share Our Lady, George Washington and the founding of the United States. Our Lady, who, under the title of the Immaculate Conception, is still today our national patroness, played an important role in the establishment of the United States and the life of our nation's most vital founding father, George Washington. It's believed Our Lady's intervention may have saved the life of General George Washington on several occasions, it's also recorded that she encouraged him at the most trying time of the American Revolution, appearing to him at his headquarters in Valley Forge during the terrible winter of 1777 and 1778. He later described her as a woman of singular beauty, and related how she said, Son of the Republic, look and learn. In the vision of the future he was then given, Washington saw the colonies take root and thrive, only to be fiercely attacked and dreadfully scourged on three different occasions, the Revolutionary War, the Civil War, and a future conflict, World War III, still to take place. A painting of the Blessed Virgin Mary hung in the Washington's residence at Mount Vernon. George Washington was friendly with Catholics and was determined to defend their right to worship. He was friends with John Carroll, the first Catholic Bishop of the United States. Washington was known to make the sign of the cross before his meals. It was a long tradition among both the Maryland Province Jesuits and the slaves of the Washington Plantation and those of the surrounding area that the first president died a Catholic. These and other facts about George Washington are reported in the Paulist Information magazine by Doran Hurley. The story is that Jesuit Father Leonard Neal was called to Mount Vernon in December 1799 from St. Mary's Mission across the Piscatawney River four hours before Washington's death. After the old general passed and Father Neal prepared to leave, he remarked to those present that they need not worry about Washington, for his soul was secure. Tradition also holds that shortly after Washington's death Father Neal sent a heavily sealed packet to Rome. If this be true, it may yet turn up in the Vatican archives, or it may have been lost during the Jesuits' hidden years. Several times as president he is reported to have slipped into a Catholic church to hear Sunday Mass. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.